Now let's up and go for it. Hope you be your papa. Hope you be your papa. Hello there, welcome to my space. Thank you so much for clicking this video. It's going to be a long one because I know it's been a while. I actually caught up with you like real time, a lot has happened. Yeah, so grab your drinks, sit back, relax, and let's have a good time watching this video. My name is Stephanie, guys, and you're welcome to the Metro Gypsy platform. So, where do I start from? Okay, the last video I uploaded. That wasn't like a short video was breakfast at tiffany's i hope you guys have gone there the food was actually delicious what i wouldn't well what's your money to be honest because the ambience was really nice you know if you go there with a good friend you'll have fun they also have afternoon tea so that's something that's another option it doesn't have to be breakfast but it's just beautiful anywho so before then it was my day out with chantelle ayamu from potaco so i spent a day with her i'm sure you watched the video a lot of you communicated with video engaged and everything thank you so much for that so i'm going to be seeing her sometime again this video is sponsored by shein you already know shein they're my babies they're my partners i have a lot of stuff from them i have some fashion i'm even supposed to do another um order i'll probably do that after this video i've just been procrastinating because my week has been hectic anywho i got some other stuff from them recently and i'll just share some of the few things i've actually unboxed on most of them in fact there's beddings that are already laying on my bed you know there's another one in storage they are beddings guys lush like soft you sleep so good she embeddings i'll put i think i'll put a picture of the one I had gotten so right now the one the stripe one is the one on the bed now and yeah so next i tried to get a different strap for my wristwatch i'm very okay with this but hope you have been asking me if i wanted to change my strap and i was like you know what since i saw it on sheen let me just get on so this one came i haven't even fixed it yet because i'm still loving my white one i'm really not that fussed over changing strap of wristwatch to be honest the wristwatch is doing what it's supposed to do but yeah this is just a way to look different because okay i actually have another wristwatch that's leather so different it depends on the kind of look i'm going for but yeah it's actually good to have this because i don't have any metallic black i have metallic but it's silver so yeah that one and what else like okay i got this keyboard and mouse this is really practical makes so much sense so pretty it's bluetooth the keyboard and mouse i use normal black ones are actually bluetooth controlled and they work perfectly working for a year since i was almost like so the year after covid I'd, I'd been using that one and i've never changed the battery or anything so this is such a beautiful pretty girly for my girly girls out there you know it comes with this so this kind of connects shadows the connection and this is the mouse it's really lights and nice and then this is the keyboard really cute so if you have a simple small work desk this would suffice you know for you i'm going to link every single thing i've gotten from them recently including the fashion and this is the discount code you should use if you're going to order in chain now when you put all the discount codes related to all the hauls i've done every time i work with chain there's a discount code so always come to check my page if you want to shop in chain just so you get coins up next i will send this um lighting thing by a brand they're actually on amazon and yeah so this is what it, you know, it comes with this it comes with this it comes with this as well and then it has this i guess it to be you know part of the fastening and stuff but with just this two you can actually get going so this is how it is it's like a door hinge you can probably put this on your table like this or hang it somewhere and then you put your light so it's just for effect it's magnetic so you fix it here and then different kind of lights can come in yeah <laughs> so this is one light it's another color another color and I'm using the remote control by the way. Red, purple, green. These things I'm pressing is just the, if you want it to uh, move continuously, there's like, you can do for five seconds, one hour, three hours. So yeah, you can just leave it going on and on and on. It's okay, just a lovely effect. When you're trying to create a mood in your room while you're filming, it kind of just gives the vibe of different kinds of lighting yeah and then there's even one that blinks shows different just control everything on your remote and yeah so i'll put the link of this as well from amazon as i said 
you can order it if you want it's really lovely efficient nice it just gives you a different vibe with when you're trying to create a certain mood in your content so life wise after seeing after the breakfast thing seeing Chantel again since the last time we saw she's actually living next week she has been here for such a long time but things work has been so busy so I couldn't see her as much as I would have loved to so after the first time we saw she had a get together I meet up with some of her subscribers and I joined them I gave her suggestions of places to go and then she chose one of them and we all went there had pasta her piano guys had pasta took pictures I'll show part of that after that we went to borough market because obviously we didn't want to call it a day it was raining it wasn't the best of weathers you know that day but we still went to borough market because we wanted to experience that chocolate and strawberry thing so when they got there after that went to tar hill i'll show the experience of borough market before i see what i've been dreaming hope it don't run out of time Wanna give it up, sick of living The verdict on the chocolate thing, to be honest, it tasted good, the strawberries were nice, but it was £7.50. I didn't think it was worth it, I wish I'd even buy it and I just tasted it from my own, because it's something you can do in your house, it's just that in Warren Market, you know, they just want to go out and, you know, have forces. But one of those things you just do. After that, um, I had this VR experience. I've never experienced um, virtual reality. Unfortunately, I've still not gotten the clips because I went there and they made a video of my experience. You guys, they said they had sent it to me, but for some reason, I've just not been able to download it or be able to share it. I'll keep chasing them, but it was amazing. I went there with my new friend that I'd met when my Amina London pop-up. I took her along, I took my PA along so but she was late so she didn't get the experience. It was lovely, like we just with it's just a lovely way to bond, team bonding, friendship bonding, family outing, you just go there, you guys play games together, kill each other, you know, just depends on the kind of games you like. So it was I'm not a game person but I really enjoyed the experience. I thought it was something really different and then it's not even that expensive and the way you remember you can get points off, you can get money off your VCs and stuff. So that's something you should check out and that's something I'm going to put. Hopefully I'll be able to get the clip so I can put it on my Instagram as a reel because I know that's where a lot of my following are. You guys need to get details on it but I'm also going to put the link to the experience. The place is not far from Hammersmith. Just literally Hammersmith station. Go through the back of the station through the... As if you're going towards Tesco then you take your right and then you shall find the place that is in a mall of its own. Which are really nice so let's talk about my channel this channel guys i'm sure you guys, you guys have seen it was even when i was at chantel's vapiano we we're just chatting with the girls and one of them was like oh, what's your youtube because they're not so many youtube people yeah i usually like to connect with people more on instagram because i think i'm more of an instagram person and then i showed the girl my account i typed it on her this and i just thought i was on 10k followers i'm like geez this was um was it I think end of July or something like that? I was like, oh my god, I'm in 10k. So I posted in my in my um, stories. I yeah, thank you, guys. In three weeks, I gained I think 13.7 more subscribers. How did this happen? Beyonce, literally Beyonce changed my life. If I would say so, going for the Beyonce show in London, I had done a reel of her. Obviously, my experience at the show. I think I did two reels: one of my me experience, my outfit and everything, and then another one of Blue Ivy dancing. Guys, for some reason, everyone just loved seeing Blue Ivy dance. I don't know. So when I saw the way people were engaging with the video, I was like, ah, okay. And I put another one. Okay, there was this... I think I was reading an article or something, and I just saw Blue Ivy at Jay-Z. So I was like, oh my god, Blue Ivy actually looks like Jay-Z so much. I just did another little shot of Blue Ivy and saying she looked like Jay-Z. <laughs> Guys, right now, that video is over i think it's up to two million or three million views right now let me even check while we're talking the video just took off like people were i think they were remixing it loving it every morning till today i wake up today is september 4th i wake up i'm still seeing comments on that video like so i reply these days i now reply i just get up and i replying the ones that can reply. there's a lot of insults as well but you know you always just do the way you want to do when it comes to social media. I don't kill yourself. 
I'm just trying to look for the video now to see how many views they had garnered. So literally, that was the video that I would say changed my trajectory on YouTube. It wasn't even any hard work or any maybe consistency. Well, consistency obviously, but normally me, I know collaborations with good YouTubers help, but that has not. I've not even had any like nice collaboration with you know people that are doing exactly what I'm doing. That I would say they will shout me out and stuff like that. So I was just, I just felt really, um, I don't know, just feel blessed that even without you know overdoing something this just came through okay i've seen it so 3.6 million views right now and if i go into my studio which i'll probably put on the screen you see the amount of subscribers i got from that video obviously these subscribers are people in america most of them are american so if i had sense i would start creating all this kind of smash or pass all these kind of things american people like well god knows like that's not even where my head is out because life has been life in so that's with my youtube oh, guys my aim and goal this year was to get to 10k subscribers right now i think i'm on 25k already as at the end of august i was on 22 so i literally and from this when i went to beyonce concert i was eight eight thousand i was still dragging eight 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 and eight seven and eight six so for between eight six and you know 21k that was in the space of three weeks it's not amazing that's i don't even know the testimony to get from this because there's no secret i did or anything it was just me you know getting a video shots you know sure okay that, i think we short sharp you get a lot of more subscribers than we long form just that we long form you get more money yeah money comes from shorts guys money comes from shorts you get more money from long form and then you get i think people that actually want to watch what you're doing you no know, shorts is just like bah, bah, bah. so you just have to continue giving them short, short stuff and keep moving if you're not even if you're currently not in the mood in that period like i was like you guys right now i'm not even like in the best of my peak a lot of things are happening and I, i'm not really like my life is not you know i'm not happy okay i don't say i'm not happy but i'm not like where i want wish i was right now in life so this thing just came at the right time because it means i'm not putting that much effort on youtube again i think it's just growing 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 and making me money you know so that's it about um, youtube so next thing i want to talk about is um this particular platform i've seen this ad in fact i didn't see it was a husband that saw it and sent it to me government boots boot camp skills boot camp thing it has to do with people that live in the uk sorry you have to be resident here i think you have to have lived for three years here you have to be a, a citizen or anything and then the government has different kind of courses that they sponsor guys 12 weeks you already have knowledge and skills you know for something you like it ranges from data stuff to tech stuff to just anything really just cyber crime just anything you think about really you know they cost a lot of the courses are there digital um, marketing so many things so i tried to register for one i think i wanted to do data analysis to see if you know that was something i like so more after the second class with the way my life was even going that period i was just not anymore i logged off it i thought i was interested again you have to start register and everything see when they're starting and stuff so i tried that and i also tried um, digital digital marketing they told me it was going to start in september so that was fine so right now i'm going to be starting it soon so while i was waiting my friend showed, told me another platform that was called generation and she wanted me to she was in aws in the aws boot camp for 12 weeks and then they had already finished that one so i couldn't register for that so what i registered for was the google cloud one guys nine to five classes as like it was just a lot for me i tried to do it for three weeks and on the third week friday of the third week i just told every guys i'm not even the thing about it is that it was good it obviously is a good skill the future you know is cloud and everything but there were so many people in class that already knew how to do um coding already knew how to use linux like it was just so crazy so when they are teaching instead of them teaching us like we that didn't know what we're doing they'll be teaching us quite fast because people are already even overdoing from what they, it was just stressful i just said you know what only for this um, thing i'd registered the data marketing and then cyber crime now came back to me okay that they are ready for data people said um september cyber crime people said october so i was like you know what maybe i'll just do that and i told those other people they're still their laptop is still here so they send laptops you guys because i think it's government that sponsors these things but listen here you don't even know this information except someone you know tells you or you just randomly see it on instagram so I'm going to put the links to that. Just look into it. Even if you're not the one, if it's your husband, just anybody that has time and, um, you know, just wants to learn something for free, you know, go and register. And it's, it's way worth it. Like, people are changing careers doing these boot camps. The good thing about this data one is just three hours in a day. 9.30 to 12, something like that. You know, it's just so sensible. Not when you take your whole day and then 
I'm going to now start on a salary that is so low from what I, I don't know it just did not make sense to me so, but if you have the time it's something you should look into so I'm going to put the link to the government bootcamp I'm going to put the link to generation so that's about it guys I'm about to eat but I just said I should do this catch up because I know if I don't <laughs> give you this vlog oh my god I forgot to talk about my hair oh my, this summer is so hot and guys you know I've always liked short hair that I said trying to tongue my hair do it was because hobby wanted a new look right now i'm back to bees like i felt so good today going to cut the hair and luckily i haven't found a new place to cut my hair where you know what they are doing so this is it i might color it and stop before this week because this week as i told you i'm going out for this i'm going to the theaters with chantel just the day before she leaves i'm going to take her out to the theater so i will take pictures i think she's now 50k on youtube so she wants to do pictures so we'll do that as well and then i was invited to a creators connecting for wednesday i'll be going with my friend i'll go go i've told her already so just gonna go she'll go from work and i'll just be in my house and then we'll go there so yeah those are the few outings i'm going um in recent times i am the godmother of my friend stephanie the baby shower i put she made me the godmother so yeah, her, the baptism of baby should, should have been in September. It's not going to be September, so that will not going to be in this vlog. It's going to be in October. So hopefully, you know, then I'll put it. So that's about it too for this vlog. If any other thing comes up, I've been cooking a lot, guys. Cooking, cooking, <laughs> cooking is as usual. I always cook. Yeah. So that's it. That's it. That's it. If any other thing comes up, I'll add it. But I'm sure this vlog is really long enough. Don't forget to go to my description box for the links to my you know recent she in hauls, the links to generation, the links to the boot camp and yeah that's it really every other thing is an event i'm going to attend and then make sure you follow me on instagram to catch up with me on all that this is my little cute sweet pillow it was from shein i hope you've looked at the shein her way i got this happening we've been loving it in the house it's woven and it's just beautiful a lovely way to just put your hand when you're watching tv all the time when i see you dancing i just feel so hard so hard but now you're gone Look into your eye, I feel so alive, alive And all the time When I see you dancing, I just feel so high, so high First one that we're doing of this type, um, you know, we've done a lot of stuff on the brand side of things. I'll also talk a lot about, a lot, hopefully, a little bit about impact.com and what it is that we do. But essentially, what we really want to do is really develop this new style of event where we can invite creators that work through our platform, that want to work through our platform, to really form a community and sort of for it to be like a private members club for. You all, essentially, not for us. We just hope we provide. Bye, W. Three days later. Hey, hey, so it's Saturday now and I'm out here for brunch with my friend but she's not feeling well. She just sent me a text now that she's really not feeling well so she can't come. So guys, it's going to be a solo day. It's crazy my last time I had this kind of thing but I was like, you know what, instead of, I have something else to do but I was like, instead of doing that, we just come and grab something to eat in this really lovely place. I'm telling my member being here and I can't wait to come here with another friend or even the same friend with when she's fine and stuff here. So I'll just show you around and then I'll just show you what I'm going to have. And from here, I'll go see my friend Julie at the um, O2. It's been a while I was at the O2, but I was supposed to see her there. She has a party there, so I just told her I'll meet her up there today after this one, you know, which was my original plan. So, yeah, nice, nice, nice. My purse actually goes with the vibe of this place. I keep it just green and stuff. Let's take it to the start. It was just me and my guitar. A dreamer on the road, no map, just all those stars. I never backed away, I played where I could play 
Loneliness befriended me, felt older than my age I let go a little, I fell for something new It was sweet for a moment, this love I never knew He called me little dreamer and said I'd be okay I let go of my ambitions and promised him I'd stay Now all of my dreams are floating like a river in my head At night in bed, talking to myself so wide awake oh, He kept telling me to let go of my goals I never questioned, I just let go of my hopes And now the vagabond who lost herself to love Oh, my lonely soul And now I'm watching as he moves on toward the road so I'm done now. The food was really good. I can't even lie. I wish I had come here with company because I was just thinking too much and stuff. But then again, I just converted it to a celebration of life, really, because things have been, you know, looking so good for me. And I can't even shout. I can't wait to bring someone here because the ambience was really, really pretty, food tasty. The um, waiter was so lovely. I got some pictures just beside the restaurant right now. I'm heading out to North Winnie to go see Julie and then I'll head home. Quite tired guys. <laughs> Guys, let's talk about Big Brother. I've been watching Big Brother as well. Big Brother, Niger All Stars. Are you guys watching Big Brother? Who's your favorite? Where well, I've watched all the Big Brother seasons. You know, my channel actually popped off because of Big Brother the first time, and then it got closed because of Big Brother, and then I started again and grew up to like 5k with Big Brother, and then I started doing other London stuff. So, my people I supported in their seasons are here. Two of them are here CC and White Money. So they are the people that I still kept on supporting because they've not really, they've actually got become better people. So, but other people I still appreciate them. But hopefully my money is on CC to win because she's a girl. Are you guys watching it though? I don't know, what do you guys think? Alex, Alex is such a snake. Doing loud mouth head and everything. But that girl tells the truth. It's just that she just, she doesn't know how to pick her battles and that she just doesn't know how to calm down when she's saying some things. Like sometimes she just talks like, bah, like, I literally kind of insult you but you know in her mind she's just being direct or being i don't know joking yeah i appreciate ships when it comes to like relationships and stuff in big brother house so i'm loving so man angel i'm loving them i'm sorry even if it's not really they have partners outside i just love what i'm seeing on my screen uh denita i say denita adequately and venita they're okay i love their intellectual you know chemistry i love the way they, they are so eloquent i love when people talk you know well that's one thing i appreciate about doing her season i didn't really like her personality in her own season but i just like the fact that she's dressing up and looking good for me to be watching i like when people speak well too for me to be watching no let me not be struggling with your struggle struggle <laughs> so yeah these people i'm sure i like them i like their friendship as a person she's okay she's okay i wouldn't say i don't like her but i appreciate her sense i know she has brain inside her head and um, who else do i like so I think that's it. So, call all the people that really like obviously I appreciate me, I appreciate fraud and all the other people. That's it, guys. Why is that talking too much? So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. And then, if you have been supporting, thank you for being a subscriber, guys. We are getting there. I'm so happy, excited with the way everything is going. There's some things happening in my life I'm not sharing right now. I'll be sharing it soon, hopefully. And there are things I'm really hopeful for that hopefully when it comes, I will also share with you. Just keep me in your prayers, guys. I love you so much. And yeah, I really appreciate the fact that you sat down to watch this video. Don't forget, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I'm Metro Gypsy. Click the thumb up button. It really helps the video go far and wide <laughs> like it has been going share this video with your friends your family and your enemies especially that boot camp and generation who said did not tell you any good thing in this life see you guys in the next one bye bye